We have snow and we have cold in the forecast, but nothing like the snow and cold they're getting in Boston right now. This storm's been going on since last night, and they're going to get over 20 inches of snow when it's all over. And there's still, as you see, some snow out in the western part of Massachusetts and Connecticut moving towards the Boston area. And as we have the satellite and radar combination, we fly out over the Midwest. We're going to see clearing skies overnight tonight and then some clouds rolling right back in because another weather system is moving in from the West. And you see the clouds already pushing through uh, areas of North and South Dakota with a little rain, sleet and snow combination. And we could see that by tomorrow evening. Just a quick note on Boston. Uh, they're going to hit over 20 inches of snow with this latest storm, 18.8 already. This month they've been over three feet of snow and it's only February 9th. Last two weeks, 68 inches of snow and the last four weeks, 70 inches of snow. And before that, they only had five inches for October, November, December and much of January, so they're really getting hit very, very hard. So uh, let's make a quick comparison between Milwaukee and Boston. And Milwaukee so far this season, 26.1 inches of snow. Boston, 71.3 inches of snow for the season. And we're about two inches below normal. They are 46 inches above normal. We're looking at cold temperatures. Uh, temperatures around here today in the 20s, uh, that's not bad, but our air for the end of the week is coming from this region where it was 35 degrees below zero Baker Lake uh, on Monday evening, 26 below zero at Yellowknife. So we're going to get some chilly air coming in Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Our overnight low temperature is cool. 10 Waukesha, 10 West Bend, 10 Sheboygan, 12 in Milwaukee. So high pressure keeping everything blocked right now and then we're going to see that high move off. Here comes an Alberta clipper and that's going to bring some very very light snow in here tomorrow late evening and overnight tomorrow night extending into uh, Wednesday morning where a few leftover snow showers could still be around and then just cold air moves in on strong northwest winds. How much snow should fall? Well we could see anywhere between around a half an inch to an inch in the Milwaukee area up to about two inches to our north. Tonight, we're looking to clear to partly cloudy skies, cold air, north winds, and an overnight low right around 12 degrees. Clouds on the increase for tomorrow, we'll call it partly to mostly cloudy. White snow develops towards the evening hours, a high of 28. Tomorrow night's when all our snow will hit later in the evening and overnight. Could see again around an inch here, maybe a little more north, 23 degrees. And into Wednesday, the warmest day of the week, up to 31, but it'll be windy with a few morning flurries or snow showers, high 31. Then we're in the teens on our seven day forecast, 14 on Friday, windy, light snow or flurries Friday, 17, 13 degrees on Saturday, 18 on Sunday. Finally, we warm to 27 Monday.